Health officials plan to ease entry rules for international business travellers whose quarantine period will be reduced from 14 days to five. The move comes as the coronavirus epidemic shows clear signs of subsiding, with no local cases reported since April 12th. Meanwhile, one expert says it's time to ease off on the social distancing rules enforced domestically. With the epidemic easing, an expert is suggesting that the Central Epidemic Command Centre relax its rules on social distancing. Currently, people are asked to keep at least 1.5 metres apart indoors and 1 metre apart outdoors. Social distancing is what's having the greatest impact on our economy. For instance, restaurants are getting fewer customers, yet it's doing relatively little for disease prevention. We should gradually phase out the restrictions. We don't need to put too much emphasis on it. In reality, mask wearing and disinfection of the environment are the most effective methods of disease prevention. But Taiwan might first see a partial lifting of restrictions on international visitors. Last Saturday, Health Minister Chen Shizhong announced plans to ease quarantine rules for business travelers. Business travelers who test negative at the border and show no symptoms after five days of quarantine will be released for a stay of two to three days, he said. When it comes to border controls, the views of experts differ. You can ease the domestic COVID restrictions, but you have to remain vigilant with your borders. You should consider proceeding under relatively strict terms. For example, perhaps there's a country that hasn't had a local case in a certain number of days. Maybe you could think about restoring some of the bilateral interactions. But in any case, you need to hammer out a set of detailed conditions. How will we deal with business travelers, academic activities, scientists and general travel? Iceland has handled testing very well domestically. Now it intends to reopen its borders, using tests to determine the terms of entry. Zhan Changquan, the dean of National Taiwan University's College of Public Health, said that Iceland has done more testing per capita than any country in the world. As part of its reopening plan, Iceland will give visitors the option of taking a COVID-19 test. If they test negative upon arrival, they won't need to go into the 14-day quarantine.